Am I the asshole? For refusing to go in another room so my fiancé and the baby could sleep alone? My fiancé Jen just gave birth to our daughter two months ago. She strictly breastfeeds, so as you can imagine, she gets far less sleep than I do. During the day I help with changing or holding her but all feedings are up to Jen the baby outright refuses a bottle we have tried several times, but ultimately we are both okay with this. Anyways, I'm kind of an independent startup video game developer. I did make one video game two years ago but it honestly wasn't that great. So while I do get revenue from it, it's definitely not much or even a livable wage. This time around however I'm working with four other people and the game is turning out great. I also work a 9-5. But after getting home, having dinner with my fiancé and looking after the baby for a while, I jump on and work on the game. For the past 2-3 nights I have been up till 1-2 am working on the game and I have been ultra tired. I snore like a maniac when I'm tired. It's super embarrassing because I truly sound like a Mack truck. But yesterday the baby had her two months shots and she was so fussy. Cried way more than normal. It was super hard for my fiancé to get her to sleep. I finally went to bed around 2 am and my fiancé immediately asked me to sleep on the couch so I wouldn't wake the baby with my snoring. I said no. I was so tired and the couch is not comfortable at all. I had to work early. I wanted to sleep. She didn't fight it but she called me a fucking prick and walked out of the room with the baby. I woke up this morning to the baby in the crib in the nursery and my fiancé asleep on the floor with no pillows blankets. She still won't talk to me. You're the asshole. Also what do you mean by helping by changing diapers? It's your responsibility as a parent. Just like you can't babysit your own kids. Or, you're tired. You poor thing. Get your snoring ass out of that bedroom, go to a sleep doctor, and try to dredge up some fucking empathy for your fiancé. You're the asshole. Her calling you a fucking prick was letting you off way too easy. You don't help by parenting. It's literally your job to change your baby's diaper and hold her. You're the asshole massively. If you're always this selfish I'd be reconsidering marrying you. You're the asshole yeah bro, be more considerate to your wife and new baby. Put them first, not you. Apologize and do something nice for her. When's the last time you did something nice for her? One paragraph in the beginning about the fiancé, baby and all that. The rest is all movie diagram s. As one dad to another, gtfo dude. Let her and your baby rest. You're the asshole. Did you read what you wrote? The person feeding your child is tired, you selfish, self-centered prick. Grow up and put yourself in he shoes. Holy hell you're the asshole. Why does your sleep trump a new mums? Grow up. If you know you snore like a freight train you should sleep on the couch. The level of disrespect is insane, I'd be calling a lawyer tbh. You really don't deserve to be talked to. You're the asshole. Yes you're the asshole in fact your fiancé summed it up perfectly you're a fucking prick. She is incredibly sleep deprived caring for your child and you're only looking out for yourself. You're the asshole buddy, you know how this one is going to go. You're the asshole. So much you're the asshole. Unless you want to be paying child support with your hobby, then you need to step the fuck up and be a man and a parent and support the woman who is keeping yours child alive. Fucking wow. Holy shit are you the asshole. You're the asshole and the fact that you need to ask Reddit about it is astonishing. Your fiancé is right. WTF us wrong with you that you can't see you're an absolute garbage husband for this. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. Even my shitty ex-boyfriend would sleep on the couch when I asked because I have sleeping problems and he snored. We didn't even have kids. I hope you make this up to your wife and treat her better going forward. Not sure what OP was trying to get at since it's pretty obvious you're the asshole obviously you're the asshole. 
Were you expecting sympathy when comparing working late nights to your fiancé being sleep-deprived and having to nurse an extra fuzzy baby? SMH. Erta. You have no empathy for your wife or your baby. I would sleep on rocks if it made my baby's life better for ten minutes. I hope you learn what it means to be a father and not sperm donor. Definitely you're the asshole. You prioritize your comfort over your babies and partners. Call in sick to the office if you really need extra sleep. See a doctor regarding your snoring. You're the asshole. Help with the baby and make mama's sleep a priority. She grew that baby and birthed the baby. You did not. Also, I am a PCP get a sleep study if your snoring is so bad. But, uh, I'll let the other editors spell it out for you. I'd cry people bother having kids they don't gaff about. Is it an ego thing? You're the asshole it shocks me how you can think anything but. Time to cowboy up. You are gonna end up on am I the devil dog. Take a deep breath, fart if you need to, and prepare to be roasted. My man get your fiancé some flowers, book a spa day for her, and apologize like WTF. Did the lack of sleep mess with your brain cells that bad? You're the asshole. You're the asshole and a fucking prick. Sleep on the MF couch like an adult human. Grounds for divorce. Put a twin bed in the baby's room and let one of you sleep in the baby's room on bad nights. Then get your snoring looked at by a doctor you're the asshole. OMG you're the asshole. You're the asshole. One million, your fiancé was right to call you OFPRCK. As a new mom myself I am so incredibly angry for her and at you. I would have left you the next day. Step up and actually be a supportive partner and a father. I'm never ever having kids. I never hear any good stories of dads. They all suck so bad just like you. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. You're the asshole. I slept in a different room on a different schedule for five months once my first kid was born. It will get better, but let mama sleep. You're the selfish asshole, pretending that snoring is something you can't fix. You're the asshole oh my god I can't say all the things you are but Jesus fuck dude get it together. You are letting Jen down so badly right now. Holy shit man. The fuck. You're the asshole. But please set aside the hobbies and focus on your family, the game can wait but the first year of your child is once in a lifetime and your wife will resent you if you don't help. You're the asshole sleep is just about the most important need a new mom has. You need to sleep separately for now so as not to cut into what little she's getting. It is very off-putting for new fathers to whine like babies. Apologize and act better. You're the asshole dude. I guess you're tired but you did this to you and your wife has to get up several times in the night to feed y'all's newborn. Learning some compassion will take you far. You're the asshole. Sleep deprivation is dangerous for the baby. Staying up late when you have work the next day and snoring are all your problems. There's no reason for you to subject your sleep-deprived wife and infant to your obnoxious snoring.